Almost every family has, is, is, is having this method, this psychological method of oppression present. This method of oppression is, is, the people don't even know it is bad in Africa. It is assault on personality. If a child, let's say a baby, my son now, let's say I'm busy doing something here, my son comes. Or I'm, even I'm not busy. The, the son, your son just comes in. Your son doesn't have the right to, to, to look at you in the eyes. So, because when he tries to look at you in the eyes, you, 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 you know, you either punish him or you say, who are you? Or kneel down or bow down or prostrate. You know, we begin to just assault. There is so much assault on personality in our homes, in our families, as people in schools, in primary schools, secondary schools, teachers use assault on personality as one of the methods of, uh, of not just punishment, of even of even uh, parenting or of um, you know you know upbringing, so assault on personality is now had been adopted. That is one of the psychological measures that people use to bring other people under their dominion. So assault on personality is a method that people use to bring other people under their dominion, and this method is being used in church today. And so, so people are being brought under the dominion of pastors. People are being brought under the dominion of churches. People are being stripped of their human rights. People are being, you know, uh, deprived of their willpower. People are being turned into slaves, and without, they don't even know it.